it seems that there's kind of trends with food products that are out there for dogs and cats, and specifically with, with dog formulations. And a, a big catchphrase that I hear in, in the appointments is grain-free. And owners think they're doing their dog a, a bonus by feeding grain-free. Uh, my personal opinion is that unless you have a confirmed allergy or intolerance to a grain, grains are not evil. Um, so I don't think that necessarily avoiding grains are going to cure all the, the dog itchy problems of the world. Um, grains are important. If you can't tolerate them, don't eat them. Um, just like a, a milk intolerant person shouldn't have a milkshake. If your dog is fine with grains, they're, they're not the big evil monster that they're sometimes made out to be. On a similar kind of avenue grains get a, a big negative that they're they're not nutritionists or they're just a filler for the food um, I think remembering back to the food triangle I think grains for people are a big you know a big item that we're supposed to eat and it's part of a balanced diet so if it's a whole grain it hasn't been processed down to where you don't recognize any part of the grain they are incredibly nutritious and as long as your dog doesn't have an allergy to it grains are fine to eat